What is going on guys, it is Albino Raven and I'm back for another one. So today, we're pretty much going to go hang out and we're going to go look for some Springbok. I've been wanting a Diamond Springbok for forever. I haven't been able to find one, so let's see what we can get into. Okay. So we're out here um, checking on some Springbok and we found some tracks. So let's go see what we can find. There's quite a few out here. Um, one thing I've learned about respawns, I don't know if you guys realize this or not, but now... If you kill females and males, pretty much every spring springbok holds a place. So it's actually good on your grinds if you want to have certain zones to have more males than females. It's actually good to take the females out as well. You have a chance of bringing them in here. So that's one thing you might guys not realize. So that's why you'll see me shooting quite a few springbok, just male or female, just anything I can get down for that reason. As you'll see, I think I ended up missing this guy a couple times. <laughs> but yes, there's a, uh, yeah, I totally screwed that up. <laughs> but yeah, so we'll go pick him up and see what he is. Uh, he's a silver scoring, not too bad. Or I'm sorry, this is the female. Oh, got her right in the neck. Oh, and this guy laid down perfectly. He's another silver as well. Uh, he's only two short of gold, so he's pretty close, but that was a nice, decent looking um, springbok there. And this is the area I'm hunting for springbok, guys. This is where you want to look for. So there are no drink zones anymore. Feed zones are the way to go, simply because they don't um, have any drink zone at all anymore. And the best way you want to use this, I'm going to show you guys which collar to use, and I'm going to show you the effectiveness of the snort wheeze I think it's called the snort wheeze collar snort weasel weezer I don't I don't remember I put it in here somewhere but yes and you guys will see just the effectiveness of this call it is amazing so if you guys want to probably one of the best ways is just to hang out and start calling trust me and you guys will see here in just a second how effective the snort wheeze collar really truly is You notice I hit it a few times, and you can see they're already freaking just coming in by the herd. I mean, here they all come. It is insanity. It's like you just told them, hey guys, free meal over here, no animals, no nothing, just come out, hang out. You know, we're having a freaking springbok party over here, so yeah. <laughs> just let me know. <laughs> you can see a few black browns in here. So black browns are actually, they're not rares but you'll see me shoot a couple of them here in just a minute because I, I like the look of them sadly you can only be females though so that is one downside i got a nice looking level four over here i'm just kind of been creeping around here a little bit going through their feed zones and i see this guy so i'm going to take him out oh perfect drop shot so the mosin is the one that i'm using here it's a 7.62 round um, a lot of people don't like it because they say it's inaccurate, which I haven't really, me personally, noticed inaccuracy with this gun, but a lot of people have. But as you can see, I mean, I'm insta dropping them really well, so, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you know. And this guy barely made gold. Looks like he's 0.8 above gold, but he's still a gold. So, that's all that matters, right? Again, that's the area that I'm hunting in. It's kind of like the savanna or whatever. And looky there. Holy crap! It's a freaking diamond potential. Oh no, wrong gun. <laughs> Don't use that one. There he is, guys. I was. I spotted him a while away. I tracked him for a long time. And I just so happened to get my sights on him. Crawled into a bush. And shablam! I couldn't believe it. I was so hyped. This is my first diamond potential ever. And he made it. 115.6. That guy is huge. Look at those horns. He is literally 0.17 away from max weight. Like, are you serious? 0.17 kilos away from max weight. 42 is max weight, in case you guys didn't realize that. But holy cow. Ugh, that was beautiful. I was so proud of that kill. So I mentioned earlier I was hanging out, kind of walking through. This is their rest zone time right now. It's, you know, you can count in the bushes and stuff, and they're all over the place. 
And I told you I was going to kill a black brown one. And boom. Drop it. And I, tried, I tried to get that guy, but I don't think I did. Or if I did, I didn't get him very well. And so, yeah. But, again, this is pretty much just to show you guys what the black brown one is. Like anyway, so. Not that big of a deal. And that Mosin, guys, like I said, I know a lot of people don't like it, but as you can tell, I mean, the results are showing for themselves. That was... <laughs> it's dropping them left and right. She was barely above silver, but she still made it. And oh my goodness, another freaking max weight estimate Springbok. Holy cow. So we're crawling through the woods here, just trying anything we can, and I see those ginormous horns. I mean ginormous. And this guy, I, I was guaranteed that he was going to score higher than the other one. And I see her, and I'm like, shoot, he's not got, she's not got that small a horn either. But yet again, that Mosin popped him right in the lung. And we go pick him up, and I was, ugh. I was so happy. Another freaking diamond. Let's go. He was 0.7 away from max weight. So he wasn't as big as the other one. 1.12. The other guy scored 115. But I was still very, very happy. So I'm going to taxidermize this guy. And we are going to go to the trophy lodge. And we're going to check them out. So I'll meet you guys at the trophy lodge. Okay, guys. We're here at the trophy lodge. And here's the deal. I got the 115 right here. And the 112 exactly right next to him. They're looking gorgeous right next to each other. I can't wait to try and get a rare Springbok. That's kind of my next goal for them. So we'll see what that brings. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you comment. Let me know what is your biggest Springbok and what animal do you want to kill as a diamond the most. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys need any more tips, tricks, anything, let me know. If you guys want me to start live streaming again on Twitch, let me know. Um, I'll try to make it work. I love you guys. Remember... Keep fishing, keep hunting, and keep praying, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Y'all have an awesome day. Peace.